Hello and welcome to another video. Uh, this one is a question that I got in my YouTube comments on a couple videos back, which is, is type annotated Python code faster than normal Python? And so let's answer that today. So the, the short answer to this is no, it is not faster. However, we will get to a way that it can be much, much faster than normal Python. Uh, but by default, type annotations in Python are not faster. They basically do nothing. They're essentially fancy comments, and without an external type checker, they don't influence the runtime at all. There actually are some cases where type annotations make your code slower, um, but most of these can be avoided, or you can kind of uh, only take that hit at import time and not otherwise. Um, I should give you an example from some bit of my code where I had <laughs> I had a particularly bad and hot piece of code that type annotations slowed down the code by about 6%. And the reason for that is, and this is actually not that code, I couldn't find the original example, so I, I found another similar example that may be slow, but uh, this code actually isn't in a hot path, so it doesn't actually matter. Um, and if we look at the code here, so this is all type annotated code. You can see like we have, you know, lists into whatever optional KD. This is an implementation of a KD tree, which is a way to uh, bisect multi-dimensional space to basically give you nearest point between three things. It doesn't actually matter what it is, but uh, this is a part of my text editor for doing nearest color. And admittedly, it's not the best for nearest color, but <laughs> none of that matters for this video. Um, but the case where you know type annotations might make some code slower, let's say this nearest function is called a lot. Um, and this is actually kind of a problem with nested functions in general in Python. <clears throat> Every time you call a function that has a nested function inside of it, this function gets instantiated. And um, if instantiating that function is expensive, you will incur a cost every time that happens. So, uh, and typing makes this particularly worse, uh, especially when you're dealing with generics in typing. So the problem that I had was I had a nested function inside the render loop for syntax highlighting, which gets called, I don't know, almost almost a million times when rendering an entire file. Um, and any little bit of optimization in that, you know, very, very tight loop made a big performance impact on the rendering of the text editor. And the one thing that was happening there was similar to what I've highlighted here. A generic in a type signature uh, was was causing that slowdown because this generic is actually implemented as a get item overload in the typing module. And so every time it was calling that get item overload and building a class and returning that new class. And so that was particularly expensive. Now the fix was pretty easy. I essentially just like took this function and moved it out here, gave it a few new arguments and uh, you know, that 6% was was gone essentially. So it was no longer building that function object every time I called that. Uh, but in this case, I'm gonna leave this here because it uh, <laughs> it isn't a performance critical piece of the code and the code is much more readable with this nested function. Um, but anyway, let's get to the actual question and the, the answer that you guys wanna see, which is the answer yes to can typed code go faster? And the magical answer to this is there are several tools I'm going to highlight one of them today called MyPyC. And the idea behind MyPyC, kind of named after you know the MyPy project itself, is this is a compiler for Python, which takes type annotated code and will return an optimized uh, you know, C Python extension module for you. And it actually has some pretty impressive benchmarks. I was looking through those before recording. These are just a few of the benchmarks that they've um, thrown up here, which are, you know, a few sample programs. And some of them are seeing like almost 17x speed up compared to normal interpreted C Python. And they're continue to, continuing to make advances in this over time. Uh, there are several programs which I know that are already using MyPyC. For instance, MyPy is using MyPyC. And oh man, when they shipped the MyPyC integration for MyPy, it made a huge difference. MyPy used to take some, somewhere around like seven to 10 seconds to run on a code base I used to work on. And after MyPy C rolled out, it was taking like 100 to 200 milliseconds. It was an amazing speed up. Um, but I, I think there's a lot of stuff that will happen in this space as you know, these Python compilers get smarter about type annotations and can produce more optimized, you know, direct machine code. I think we'll see a lot more performance benefits here. Um, similar to like how Cython 
um, a more mature project uses C annotations to make code go faster. Um, but anyway, I think this is a, a really cool space and I, I do think like typing will be important to speeding up Python uh, in the future. But anyway, hopefully that answers that question. If you have additional things you want me to explain, leave a comment below or reach out to me on the various platforms. But thank you all for watching and I will see you in the next one.